Isaiah 45, verse 7. I form the light and create darkness. I make peace and create evil. I, the Lord, Yahweh, do all these things. Call Allah Yahweh, by Shem, Yahweh Shai, by Shem, Rakakarash, the bonus to the elders and the apostles of great millstone who rule well. Right, shalom to the whole field like men that scattered abroad, pushing the truth without sincerity, and shalom to the very few sincere sisters that's taking heed, right? So you all say shalom. And just a quick lesson, you know, the same old, the basics, right? Fearing the Lord, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, right? Because we at a point now, now more so than ever of, of heavy judgment, you know, and it's only going to keep increasing, right? And, and each and every day, the Lord is showing you he's the power of the earth. He's the one that's going to give out that judgment, you know? <clears throat> and, you know, hey, we always preach, you know, to fear the Lord, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, so he can suck with you, give you that wisdom, that truth, and understanding, right? Well, I'm, I'm going to jump to that right quick. And and I'm gonna proceed. Um, Proverbs one, <laughs> right? Um, Proverbs one, and I'm gonna go to verse five and verse seven, right? A wise man, verse five. A wise man will hear and will increase learning, and a man of understanding shall attain unto the wise counsels. Right? Coming into this truth, you're gonna you know seek out the ancients of the old, the prophecies. Right? You're gonna listen to the elders and the apostles. Right? Of GMS, Great Millstone. Right? And, and, and learn, eat, and learn how to eat the whole roll, right? And um, um, um you know, starting with the um, uh, the law, statute, commandments to the best of your ability, right? And and growing from there, right? Because that's also just showing you that you fear the Lord, right? You're pulling yourself apart, right? Because the Lord, right, right now, the Lord is um, <laughs> is, is doing heavy judgment, heavy sifting, you know. But if you're one of the ones that's Taking this wisdom, not truth, and understanding, and you're growing with it, you're doing something with it, you're not hiding your, your light, right? And the Lord's gonna, um, you know, uh, exempt you from these these judgments that's coming, man, you know. But I just want to just, you know, just show you, hey, it's, it's, it's a lot of, um, it's a lot of uh, judgment going out. And let me read verse seven, my bad. The fear of the Lord, Yahweh, is the beginning of knowledge, right? But fools despise wisdom and instruction, right? And, 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 you know, you despising that wisdom instruction is going to lead to what a grave, right? Because now you're going out in your own way. Scripture says, they're the way that seem right into a man, but the end are the ways of death. Um, damn, I think it's 1422. If it's not, I'm just keep going. I can't remember it off the top of, the top of my head. But I know, oh, there you go. Call all y'all by Shemel Shah. 14 and 12. There is a way which seemeth right into a man. But the end are, are but the end thereof are the ways of death, right? Just the point, you know, leaning off your own understanding will cause you to die, right? And the Lord's gonna, you know, hey, make sure he stand on that, <laughs> you know. But um, yeah, just gonna show you that hey man, how about you the one that's doing all this, man, right? When you cut on these news articles, that's all you're seeing is death, 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 right? And the Lord is increasing these to put the spirit on these people to do things, man, right? Let's start off with this one, right? And I'm just reading the titles of them, man. You know, just just showing, you know, just you know, just going to the titles, man. Right. Um, fourteen year old stabbed by male relative on Sunday afternoon, right in Atlanta, right. And, and that just what's going on, man. Right. The scripture, matter of fact, I ain't gonna say the scripture. Say let, let's grab him. Let's grab him. Right. Um, Matthew chapter twenty four, right? Because scripture says, matter of fact, let me get verse ten. Chapter 10, so like you. Yeah. And I'm going to just go from there and jump to Matthew 24 after that. <clears throat> right? The scripture says, Matthew 10, verse 34, Think not that I am come to send peace on earth. I came not to send peace, but a sword. For I am come to set a man at variance against his father, and the daughter against her mother, and the daughter-in-law against her mother-in-law. And a man's foes shall be they of his own household, right? So you talking about a, you talking about family that's within a household that's going to have division, right? So just how much more you talk about a cousin, a person that you don't really see on a daily basis, or an auntie, you know, right? Just be outside the house. How much more that, you know? It's only going to keep increasing, right? But the Lord said He created these evils, right? Let's go to um twenty four. <clears throat> And twelve, right? And 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 when you start, you know, reading from verse three on down, right? Your Lord, the Lord Yahweh Shah, right? Telling the disciples, you know, these signs and what you're going to see in these in these latter days, man, right? That's what the 
the uh, the question that the you know the disciples had for Lord Yahweh Shah. You know, but um verse twelve it says, and because iniquity shall abound, right? It abound in what as meaning it's going to what increase. It said the love of many shall wax cold, right? And, and you talking about stabbing, that's that's different from just shooting something. That's a quick that's a quick death. Right? When you stabbing somebody, that's that's a real killing, you know. So hey, the love of many is really waxing cold out here, man. Right? Um and hey, the Lord Yahweh shot, hey, the one that started it, man. <laughs> right? Dang, look, this one just came in. Murder suspect out on bond killed another person after his ankle monitor ran out of battery. <laughs> hey man, the Lord has got hey, the Lord got the spears on these folks, man. Right? Um let's go down some more. Right? Look, twenty four year old woman dies at the wrong way head on collision on Georgia Four Hunter, right? And and I don't stay too I, st I don't stay too far. I stay like ten minutes from right here, right from <laughs> from right here, man. But hey, but the Lord is a hey, bringing out judgment, man. He said, "I won't, I kill, I make alive." Right? <clears throat> is there any that can deliver out of my hands? Right? Oof, here go another one. You know this ain't gonna be too long. Just bringing out the point, man. Hey, Lord, you have a shot. It's, it's fed up, man. Right? If I can get this to to lock it. Okay. A 24-year-old woman was found dead in the trunk of a car. Now police believe her husband fled the country. Man, I just brought it out, right? Matthew chapter 10. A man's enemy said that be of his own of his own household. Right? Roughly paraphrasing. Right, let's let's grab some um let me grab a scripture right quick. Let's go to the book of uh Deuteronomy thirty two and let's hit birth the verse thirty nine the point. It says, See now that I, even I, am he, and there is no God with me. There is no power with the Lord, right? It's only him. Right, and what he what he has done is given the um his his power down to what to Lord Yahweh Shai, you know. Outside of that is nobody else. These are just idols, man. Right, the Lord is terrorizing this place, man. But that goes into his his name, his, his nickname, as you can say, man. Right. Um. Um. I should, um. Uh. I can't even get the word out of my mouth. It'll come back to me. Right, but it goes into demon like power. Alashaya, right? Call it like Alashaya, right? Alashaya, you know, a, demon, a terrible, demon, you know, demon-like power, you know, because hey, the way he coming out with judgment, you would think he don't, he don't like nobody, but nah, man, it just, when you you set an example, you set an example, and that's just that, you know, so the Lord is, hey, letting it be known, right? It says, see, now that I, even I am he, and there's no power with me, I kill, I make alive, I wound, and I heal. Neither is there any that can deliver out of my hand, right? And even with us, you know, no other nation can deliver out of Yahweh Shem Yahweh hand. We can't, we can't, no other nation can deliver us out of this slavery, but the Lord Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah, you know? Hey, when, hey, when, when he want to bring down that judgment, there's nothing you can do, man. He send them angels and them angels get to working, right? As you can see, and tomorrow you're going to see a whole nother list, Right? But it said the man fled the country. <laughs> right? It said nothing. Look, one dead in the wrong way crash on Sunday. Oh, this is the same one on Georgia 400. Yeah. It's another one. I think it's in. Uh, is it First Chronicles fifteen? No, I think it is. I think it's thirty six. No, nah, Second Chronicles thirty six. Fifteen. No, it's another one. Dang, what's up? It's another one. I'm probably tripping. Mm. 
It's been somewhere in Second Chronicles. I can't remember. All right. Um. Hey, here go another one. This no, this will be the last one. All right, and it's a heavy one. <laughs> it says a one and two year old boy died after their mother, who had struggled with undiagnosed mental illness since childhood, turned the kitchen range on and put them inside. Mother sentence, right? And I actually know the dude, the, uh, the dad, you know, and man, he was sick, right? He was sick, man. Cause right when you go into this article, I mean, I know what the article really hitting on, but you know, uh, <clears throat> and she actually FaceTimed him, man, you know, she FaceTimed him and he was literally watching his sons being in the oven and he had, you know, three, he had three sons, you know, the oldest one was the one that survived and he sat there and watched. You know, his mom made him watch, you know, but hey, the Lord ain't sparing, man. You know, but, but the, um, you know, Jake was just like, hey, at the funeral, I couldn't even tell which child was which. That's how birthday was, you know. And, and you know, when you just, hey, when you understand the Lord, yeah, how about you, you know, understand these scriptures, you already know, hey, everybody has a past life, man. You know, so those kids was not, they didn't die being innocent, as the scripture says. <laughs> they had a past life, most likely they had to be in, being, they had to been wicked as fuck, you know, to go ahead and get sent up out of here early, right? And then also, hey, the Lord put the spirit on what? These people to do so, to do it, to, f to fulfill what he needs to be done, right? And I know also with, with the girl, I think, um, if I'm mistaken, you know, what also messed her up was she seen, she came home to see her dad passed out, you know, dead, you know, in, on on the floor, you know, so that really messed her up. And that was really like her, <clears throat> the one she really looked up to the most was her dad, you know. But hey, man, yeah, but Shema Shah is not bullshit, right? And I'm going to close out with this one last scripture, right? <laughs> and you already know where I'm going, man. Ezekiel chapter 9, right? This is all about fearing the Lord, man, right? When the Lord say he's sending out those angels, man, he going he gonna to send them out, right? Ezekiel chapter 9, verse 4. And the Lord, Yahweh, said unto him, Go through the midst of the city, through the midst of Jerusalem, right? Jerusalem being a people before it's a place. And set a mark upon the foreheads of the men that sign that cry for all the abomination that be done in the midst thereof, right? Going to the, 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 the Hebrew word for mark, but going to Tawa, right? Going to exempt from judgment, right? Exempt from judgment. So, a hey, so, you know, it happened that, then and it's, you know, it's happening now. Right, the Lord is a having his angel set marks upon the man that signed the crime, the one that's actually doing the will. Hey, move them out the way. Don't 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 touch them. You know, they doing what they're supposed to be doing. Hey, but the rest of them, yeah, go see about them. You know, it's just and set a mark upon the foreheads of the men that signed that cry for all the abominations that be done in the midst thereof. Right, this where it get greasy at. And to the others, he said in my hearing. Right, the one that's that the one that don't have that mark, the other exempt from judgment. It says, "Go ye after him through the city, and smite, right, unalive." D e a d, k i l to the l, right. Let not your eyes spare, right. Neither have ye pity. So that means, guess what? You're not caring about. Oh, it's a three-year-old, it's a one-year-old, it's a two-year-old, it's a toddler, it's an infant, you know? The Lord said, go through the midst of the city and smite. Right? That's the power that's that's really that 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 that's you know making 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 moves, man. You know, this we're not telling you to fear the Lord for no reason. Right? It's about what he can do. Right? Let me let me let me jump right quick and let me jump back. Matthew 10 and um because I seen it earlier. You know, I just want to bring out just the end of the, uh, the the second part of this precept. It says Matthew 10, verse 28, and fear not them which kill the body, but are not able to kill the soul, but rather fear him which is able to destroy both soul and body in hell. Right now is really the point, right? This is why we fear the Lord, right? He could destroy <laughs> your flesh and he could destroy your, your soul, man. Really erase you up out of here, right? Let me go back. <clears throat> Ezekiel 9, verse, what was that? I saw that 5 again. He said, and to the others, he said, in my hearing, go ye after him through the midst of the city, through the city, so like him, and smite. Let not your eyes spare, neither have ye pity. 
but it says slay, right? Slay utterly old and young, both maids and little children and women, right? But come not near any male upon whom is the mark and begin at my sanctuary. And then they begin at the ancient men, which were before the house, right? But hey, it says, it's verse 6, the, you know, really about that main point. It says, slay utterly old and young, right? Both maids and little children, right? So, hey, like I say, you know, going back to that last, you know, article with this, hey, the, the, the angel was on a mission, you know? This is why we pray, you know what I'm saying? We pray fast, you know, that, hey, that the Lord has a, 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 that mark, that thawa, right, upon us and our children, man, you know? Because if we don't feel the Lord, hey, our babies are definitely going to be through, you know? But kind, um, <clears throat> excuse me. But yeah, um, like I said, you know, this is just a quick fear the Lord video. You know, it's, it's definitely gonna be a whole nother list of this of of, of this tomorrow. <laughs> you know, but we definitely in that time, man. Right, we definitely in that time of, of heavy judgment, and it's only gonna get worse. Right, so I'm gonna close out with that, and I'm gonna give out on the glory and praises to Yahweh, Bashim Yahweh Shah, Bashim Kagadash. Till next time, Shalom.